In this video we're going to look at headway in traffic. Uh, so um, it says, well on four lane highways the probability P that the headway is at least T seconds is given by P equals 0 0.87 to the power of T. Okay, so what does headway mean? Headway means how far is the car in front of you, basically. Uh, so by law you should be five seconds apart, right? Uh, depends on the state, it might be three seconds. But is it five seconds apart or is the car ahead of you uh, one second apart? That's the headway. And of course, you know, w we didn't even talk about in this, we're not even talking about what the speed limit is, but we're just saying that um, you can kind of ignore the speed limit th with this formula and just say, look, when 500 vehicles per hour are traveling one way on a four lane highway, what's the probability that, you know, um, that, uh, what, what's the type of spacing you can expect to see uh, if you're driving in that road? Okay, so how far, how far ahead are, is the car going to be in front of you, basically, or behind you? So, so in any case, what is the probability the headway is at least one second. So if we answer this first question, then we'll do for two seconds and thirty seconds. But for the first question, at least one second, that means that t equals one. Okay, t equals one. Now, um, so what does p equal? Well, p equals zero point eight seven to the power of what? To the power of t, right, to the power of 1, which is 0 0.87. What does that mean, probability 0 0.87? Well, here's my advice. Turn it into a percentage and then think about it. Turn that decimal into a percentage. As a percentage, that is, move the decimal point two spaces to the right, and we get 87 percent. The probability the headway is at least one second is 87 percent. What does that mean? It means that yeah it's very very likely 100 percent probability is definite right but it's very very likely that the car in front of you is not going to be at one second. It's, it's not saying that you're, it's, it's most likely to be one second at all. Did you notice that? It's at least one second, which means the car ahead of you could be one second apart, could be, um, you know, two seconds apart, could be um, three seconds apart, could be four seconds apart, or five or six or seven or eight or nine or ten or eleven seconds apart or twenty seconds apart but at least one second apart quite likely okay so let's do the next one um, and figure out what is the probability that the car ahead of you the headway is at least two seconds remember this is at least two seconds so t equals two P equals what? 0 0.87 to the power of. Press pause and do this and figure it out. Turn it into a percentage. Press pause and do the whole thing. To the power of 2. And then you square that in your calculator. And we get 0 0.7567. We'll round that to two decimal places. Zero point round this to two decimal places, what do you get? Zero point seven six. And now turn that into a percentage. Turn it into a percentage, what do you get? Move this point two places to the right, seventy six percent, right? Now, so what is it saying? The probability that the headway is two seconds, three seconds, four seconds, five seconds, six seconds apart or any of those because at least 
probability that the headway is at least two seconds is a good chance, 76%. So, you, I mean, two seconds is very close, but it's not as bad as one second. So, anyway. Um, so, of course, this, this formula would change if there were, say, only 100 vehicles on that stretch of road. Uh, or if there were a thousand vehicles on the stretch of road, then it would uh, it would change again. So, what's the probability that there will be thirty seconds ahead? That if you're on driving on this road, there will be thirty seconds between you and the car in front of you. Nice, lots of open space. What's the probability of that happening? Happening at least thirty seconds ahead. Thirty or thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three. Right. Press pause and do that. I'll do it now, so P would be 0 0.87 to the power of 30 and I get 0 0.015 so that's approximately 0 0.015 uh, ran that to, uh, uh, turn it into a uh, percentage and I get 1.5 percent. Okay, so the probability that the car ahead of me is going to be at least 30 seconds ahead of me, like way ahead, very low chance, one and a half percent, right? So it's kind of saying you're you're probably looking at um, close traffic under under these conditions.